getting a lot of flack about this uh, NFL boycott. I'm getting a lot of support too, which is really good. Um, when I talked about this last year <clears throat> with uh, the kneeling and all that and the Colin Kaepernick stuff, it wasn't quite as a warm reception as I would have thought. Um, I think I was kind of outnumbered at that point, but I don't think I'm outnumbered anymore um, as far as the NFL goes and uh, you know other sports too, but mainly the NFL because that's what I used to watch. Um, you know, tons of support uh, with, uh, you know, the, the boycott, which I hate to use the word boycott. I'm not boycotting. I just don't give a crap. Um, I'm not actively working to get people to boycott or whatever. I don't care if people watch or don't. I'm just stating my opinion and if people agree, great. If you don't, great. I don't really care. But um, some people are like, well, why do you let the players you know, dictate what you enjoy, like, why don't you just enjoy the, uh, you know, the sport in spite of the players, well, the sport is the players, and I mean, you know, I use this analogy, if you had a girlfriend that, you know, treated you like complete garbage, took you for granted, didn't understand you, you know, just basically undermined you like every step of the way. And uh, you were like, went to your friend and you're like, dude, I think I want to break up with her. And the dude was like, why let all that stuff get in the way of your relationship? You know, why get let all that stuff get in the way of enjoying dating? You know, I mean, it doesn't make any sense in that context. And it's the same with the NFL. <coughs> I can't watch these guys knowing that they're being complete douchebags and completely out of touch with what their fans want. We don't we don't watch them to get their opinion on, you know, sex, drugs, rock and roll, politics, whatever. We watch them to play the game. That's their job. Their job is to play the game. They get paid hundreds of millions of dollars to play a freaking game. And they can't even do that without, you know, dragging uh you know, politics and social justice and whatever, in, you know, into the mix, which is not what I want. If I wanted that, I'd watch CNN or I'd watch Fox News or I'd watch, you know, any number of things. You know, I'd go on Twitter and uh, I could get enough of that in five minutes to last me a lifetime. But uh, anyway, so that's why. Um, you know, I mean, imagine I own my own business and I, do, I provide a product for the customer. Well, imagine if I... In within embedded in that product was everything that I believe about life and what I think everyone else should believe and you know I disrespect their wife their president their you know whatever how long do you think I would be employed with them probably probably not that long even if I provided a good service the extras are not what they paid for and they're divisive and annoying as hell so I mean that's kind of where I'm at and uh I'm not, you know, week two, I haven't watched a game, haven't kept up with scores. I don't know who won, lost, whatever. I do know that Saquon Barkley uh, tore an ACL. I saw that on Twitter. But, um, you know, so prayers up to him. I don't, I don't want to see that happen to anybody. I don't know his stance on anything. I don't care. Um, you know, nobody should have to tear an ACL. But anyway, you know, I, I don't miss it. Um, and that, that's the thing that people don't understand, and or not people, that's what the NFL doesn't understand. We don't need them. You know, most of, well, I, I, most of us don't need them. Most of us have enough going on in life to where we can, you know, make our lives fun in other ways. You know, we don't need the NFL. I'm not sitting around waiting for, you know, with, on, with bated breath, you know, what the NFL is going to do or whatever. I don't miss it at all. Um, it was a nice pastime. I enjoyed it on, you know, Sundays, you know, Fridays, whatever, you know, I used to watch it pretty much every, any time a game was on, but ultimately I don't need it. I don't want to look at their freaking pouty, super rich, stupid faces telling me about, you know, social injustice and inequity and, you know, whatever in the world. It's like, just shut up and play, throw the ball, catch the ball, run really fast. That's your job. If I wanted to know what you thought about, you know, what color the sky is, I'll check your Twitter or, you know, your Facebook page. Other than that, I don't care. So anyway, the NFL better get with the program because uh, the ratings are not going to support these player salaries for very long, if they are even now. I mean, you know, the 40% cut in ratings is not what uh, the owners had in mind, I'm sure. 
but you know, they've been, they've been fed a line of crap by their handlers and uh, told that this is what the people want and this is what's popular and they're finding out that it's not. Um, you know, there's a small group of people who think it's great. Um, there's a small group of people who don't care and there's a big group of people who think it's a bunch of crap and are turning the TV off and going fishing. So anyway, I hope they get it together. I mean, I don't know what they could actually do at this point. Um, it's too pretty much too far out of control for the NFL. I mean, it's can they save it? I don't know. You know, they would need a massive public apology. They would need to tell these idiots to, you know, stand the hell up. I don't care if they salute the flag. What I, mean, I don't give a crap about any of that. You know, they're free men. They can do what they want. But uh, I don't care if they stand there with their arms crossed. But, you know... You're not gonna. You're not gonna look at me and say, you know, Black Lives Matter and all this other bull crap and these terrorist organizations, you know, are are you know going to be the focal point. You're not gonna run around with a rapist name on your helmet and expect me to watch. You're just not. So as long as they continue that, it is what it is. I'm turning it off.